Okay, so I want to show you how easy it is to add Pinterest to your website or blog. First thing is you come to the widget builder um, and you can get there really just through doing a Google search for Pinterest widget builder. Now in order to place it onto the body of a website page or a blog, I'm going to click board widget. And there I have it, I have it selected. Now I'm going to come and I'm going to get the Pinterest board URL. Yes, it is that easy. I'm going to come, this is the board I want to embed. I'm gonna come, I'm gonna hit edit, copy. I'm going to come back to my widget builder in Pinterest. I'm going to come right here. I'm going to paste in the URL. I am going to click build it. I'm gonna just stick with the size and there it is. The last step is I come and I take this code, I come, I edit, I copy, and I'm working in WordPress, so I'm gonna to come to my new page in WordPress. I'm going to go into the um, HTML, it's the text in here. Uh, so, you know, if you're working on a website, if you're working in Dreamweaver, you'd make sure that you would put it in the code view and put it right into the HTML. I'm going to paste that in and I am going to publish it. Then I can come on over and I can view the page. And yes, it is that easy, there it is. Now, I can come back in and what's really awesome about this is I can keep adding artwork to this image. I can keep adding images here. Now, the only thing is though, if you come in and you edit the board and if you change this name up here, it will change the URL. So just be careful of that. You just have to go through the steps and redo it. But again, um, as you change images on the board, it will also change uh, right on your site. Thanks so much.